Okay, my babe says she not come my house because rain fall water day. See my side chick, my side chick cross a a use canoe come my house. I think my nobody like that, but you must have to <coughs> testing the microphone. <coughs> hey, make make I drop on this. So I'm going to be telling you guys the reason why side chicks are better than wives. I'm going to be starting off to explain the three levels of side chick, yeah. There are three levels of psychic. There's one that's just a regular person, a random person. It could have been someone he met on the street. It could have been someone that you just introduce you to, like a fellow friend, guy you don't follow on day. You just want to follow on day for psychic. I'm saying this, but as a married man, actually, because he never married, they get psychic. I don't understand which one comes with the mean. You don't know the mean yet. Until you're married, you get that's why I feel like it's for married men. Now, um, that one is level one. Ah, uh, you were just going to the road, you just met a one day, just the uh -huh. you guys may be seen frequently, you understand, but you know today regard her like she just is here as commodity. You just do you pay once once. And mostly this level one side check only when you see her. Then you go feel pay. You, it is not a situation of whereby you did a Abuja, she did Lagos, she can't call you for money. You just say, nah, when you know, see her. Do you understand? That's level one. Now there's level two. Now don't go higher. Do you understand? Now this person might see you as, ah, they now see you maybe beyond that one night stuff. That he now sees you as, um, important. He might now tell you things maybe about his business or his family or his wife and he may not even be coming to your house you understand if he come your house he can send you money without you seeing him you understand like if you just call him i felt i want to do so and so you send him but for level one you know the same but for level two you don't they see say when i go they talk if they send you money it might not be much Oh yes, you go the same. That's level two. The level three, hey hey, level three can be a random person who grew from level one to three, or level three could be a a fling in the past. Like it could be your ex girlfriend. It could be somebody you knew before you got married. That those are level three, and these level three side chicks are the ones they don't joke with. Like I don't know if you've ever seen. Is that type of side chick where they you hear say man go to talk say if you touch her as a wife maybe you just you know if you see your husband sitting outside if it's not level one if you go there shaft for the gate then you're mad bitter but you dare not touch a level three side chick because your husband is going to show you a side that you have never seen before so that level three na the highest at the highest so you cannot touch the level that level three side chick are, uh, are the ones that they carry for occasion like i can be in lagos yeah but my side chick is in um abuja and i'm going to potter court i will fly her from that abuja to potter court because she's the only one i want to be seen with like she's the only one most times the only one for you to have a level three side chick that means only one side chick you will have i don't know if you understand so those are the levels of side chick well detailed well explained but if you feel like i'm not explaining too much no while if you tell me i feel do another different video just to explain psychic for you guys so let me go to the reason why i tell you that psychics are better than wives mind you this page does not support violence i am in no way support of psychics i'm only giving you the facts i do not support psychics i feel like cheating on your wife is the highest form of disrespect cheating and beating at the same level they did for me so i am not supporting but i'm just going to tell you facts because that's what i do i tell you facts so first of all when you have a side chick as a man you put your wife in a competition that she is not aware of let me take you back now do you remember when um you guys were dating hmm? and as a girl you are dating the guy because you want to be the one you now be washing, be cleaning, be nice, wife material, so you'll be picked. 
you understand and when you are not dating you gotta wear fine fine dress you know make people they see you but now when you don't date you gotta reason say well i've already seen the one what's the need for all the effort and as a guy too you gotta say ah god me i don't think i just married this woman man it's not only me day. so the moment you have a side chick you put your wife in a competition she's not aware about you know that time where she did you never marry her she knows she did competition she likes to like dress the best cook the nicest wear this one but now if she don't marry she will laugh like it's my man now why do i have to stress it do you get your side chick on the other hand knows fully well that she's in a competition so what does she do she will always win how can you be in a competition you don't know you will lose now so she will dress the best in fact every money you give her she um she puts it on her look her hair her dress her everything might probably cook you know and your wife on the other hand is like ah, no, my husband i'm not today what i want to do again what i want to do you never seen before so first of all and you start comparing that's why you hear some people now start saying hey my wife safe can I even dress nice in the house my other side chick she wears fine dress she wears, is she know what she did do now she know she already know now now your wife don't know do you understand then um as a wife i feel like men your side chicks tell you your side chicks tell you want to hear like oh mo, you are so good they might, might tell you you look so good when you don't look good they might tell you ah you smell nice when you don't smell nice they might tell you oh you're the best in bed when you're not the best embedded anything that will make you feel good they are going to do anything you want they're going to give it to you but your wife is not going to be like that she's not going to give you anything you want that's why you hear stuff like if i call my babe and eh, my babe station off you come my house because rain for what are they see my side chick my side chick cross a a cruise can you come my house because your wife does not see the need she does not see the effort but your side chick is in the competition and she wants to put her head in the game so whatever she wants, whatever you want, she will do, but your wife will not do that. Your wife that goes to work every day, stresses herself if she has children, and maybe that night she's very tired, and you're like, be blessed, and she's like, I don't have strength. But you said you can never say that. She will not say that now. So and you're not comparing her to your wife. It's very stupid. I feel like that's the most stupid thing that men do because psychics will always win. Do you understand? They're always ready, they are prepared. You every year side chick be saying, except she's a level three side chick. It's not a level three side chick. She can't say that. They are always there for you in your downest moment. Anything they are there. Ah, my your back is pain. Let me do it. Are you don't worry. Let me do it because their sight is funny enough. If the roles were reversed, if those people become your wife today, they will be the same thing your wife is. That's just the truth. They know what they're after. They're after the money. They don't care about you at all except for those that are witches that are looking for marriage i want to steal people's homes but the real psychics those that know why they're in the game they're there for the money they don't care about you and some people be thinking they love you they don't love you they're just for me it's for the money so a psychic will always be better her head is in the game she's she's there she knows what to do knows what to say your wife will your wife will argue with you Tell you, babe, this thing you did is not nice. I don't like it. You should not. Your side chick will say, Oh, it's fine. I'm so sorry. Is this? And you'll not be comparing. Say, See how my side chick is so calm. She's so nice. She doesn't say, well, She will not nag. She will not nag because she knows why she's there for the money. And if she nags, she, what's the difference between her and the, uh, the wife? So please, it's very, very stupid when you guys actually say, my side chick is better than my wife because she will always be better. Of course, you are, you are dating. Your wife probably has given birth. And probably her body is not the way it used to be. Your side chick never born. In most cases. So she's still. Mm, her body still day. So why are you going to compare your wife with your side chick? Because your side chick will always be better. The advice I will have, you, uh, have to tell you guys. Is that it's not worth it at the end of the day. Having a side chick is not going to. It's not worth it in any way. But for who better pass. No vessel. Most times. You be side chick. And that your side chick now, being not really you. This one they give her money. This one they give her money. So she tends to look good all the time. Tends to as in anything we want, she will give you. But your wife, on the other hand, don't do that. 
So please, ask you want to understand that side chicks are better than wife because uh, they are in the game. So they do everything for the game. But your wife cares about you, respects you, has her own problems, puts herself, puts herself in the picture. Why? Right? It's actually not even put herself at all. They just put you, 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 you. Make sure you are happy. Tickets. So guys, I'll see you guys in another video.